presenting the Leica MP6. Some viewers have been asking me to do a video about my camera, so here it is, the Leica MP6. In the early 2000s, Leica decided to make a modern version of the famed and rare original Leica MP, a favourite of famous photojournalists. The MP was seen to be an improvement on the M6, with a better finder, higher quality internals and a better build quality. MP is said to stand for mechanical perfection. At the time, the Japanese market was very important to Leica, so they decided to release a special edition just for Japan, and the MP6 was born. The camera is functionally the same as a modern MP, with fully mechanical functions, a light meter, and a coated finder to reduce flare. But it has a few features that set it apart from the standard MP. For a start, there's an engraving on the top plate, which features the Leica Camera AG Germany legend. And of course, the MP6 engraving. Why 6? Perhaps Leica would care to enlighten us. The vulcanite covering is in the classical style, rather than the shark skin on the MP. It was said that 400 of these cameras were to be made, but the true figure is around 250, as demand was poor. The cameras were made in two batches, with earlier serial number cameras using the M6 TTL ISO dial, and later cameras using the MP ISO dial. Mine is from an early batch. To this camera, I have added the Leicavit Rapid Winder and the MP Rewind Crank. It took me years to find the crank in black paint. I am using my favourite lens, the Summicron 35mm f2 Aspherical. This is the Black Paint Millennium Edition, so the curtains match the carpet, as they say. All that brass makes for a heavy camera, though. As I mentioned, this is my camera and I use it regularly. I don't baby it and it has seen its fair share of action and it's still going strong. Each mark is a memory. I got this camera as a present to myself when JCH started to become successful and it definitely wasn't the price that you see them for today. But that doesn't matter to me. It's mine and it's not for sale, not now or ever. So, pros and cons. Pros, looks cool perfectly suited to my shooting requirements, thick, doubles as a weapon. Cons, expensive, heavy as anything, people mark you as a Leica wanker. Please like, subscribe and comment below. You can see this and much more at japancamerahunter.com.